Hey, what is going on everybody? Scott Gaming here, thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're about to start playing some more PES 2021. Uh, this time around, we're going to play Master League. I apologise if you've been into the uh, into the, the Become a Legend. Maybe we'll revisit it at some point. But uh, I was getting a little bit fed up of, of only touching the ball like twice or three times. I thought we'd try something different and something that I'm going to lose a lot at. Um, Master League, if you don't know, is kind of the... The career mode in uh, in Pro Evo, you start with a random uh, collection of players, uh, and then you um, and Steven Gerrard as your manager, obviously, uh, and and try and uh, try and work your way up from the leagues. So we're going to start in the Championship, as you can see, our manager is Steven Gerrard. We are Scott Dog FC, obviously, as you can see from the badge on our on our uh, on shirts there. Um, but uh, yeah, we're going to give this a, we're going to give this a little go. Uh, but there is a twist. We are playing this on uh, Superstar, which is the hardest level um, that you can play. Uh, additionally, we are playing with uh, full manual controls. So um, essentially, uh, when you pass, normally the game will give you an assist with the weight of the pass, the direction of the pass, none of that. When you shoot, the game will give you an assist with the kind of direction, uh, none of that. We're going all in on the... Uh, on the uh, on the manual, we're just going to see how we go. Um, eighth position, I think we can finish in the top half of league. I don't think we're finishing eighth. I'm going to be honest. Um, Sixteen position or higher. Okay, they they seem to be nodding. I guess that's that's good news. We're never going to finish there. We're not going to win any games really. Here he is. His Stevie G is coming out to meet the meet the press. As you can see. He's not looking very happy. What's your plan? Um, I have my own ideas. I say thank you to the chairperson, sorry, chairperson, the sports director for believing in me. My first job here is to teach the team my brand of football. If a player finds himself unable to adapt, then he'll be sent packing. Wow. Um, what style of football do you play? I want to see clean sportsman like football. I want to put on a show. I want the boys to see the boys play hard. No, go with that one. Uh, we won't read that. As, you know, let's be honest, it's going to be garbage. Um, it's almost as bad as doing a press conference in um, in Football Manager. So um, we've got uh, some news. Let's go and have a little look here. We can see that um, we've got some training regimes, some scouting, and we've got a budget we can manage, um, and a few other things. The first thing we are going to do is come into the manager's office and go to budget settings. Um, and we are going to change all of this to salary budget from the uh, from the get-go, I think because we want uh, we want money to come in and go into our salary because we're not going to be really going to be able to to buy anybody good. Additionally, I think we need to figure out what kind of what kind of tactic we're going to play. Uh, as you can see, if you've played Master League before, some of these names will be uh, well known to you. I think we're going to go with something like this, but I think what we might do is push these guys up just a little bit higher. Um Maybe we'll keep you as a right uh, a right uh, a right midfielder and you as a left winger. Maybe, maybe something along those lines, uh, and we could move you that way a little bit. We'll go with something like this. I don't really know how it's gonna how it's gonna play out. Let's just pull the fullbacks back just a little bit. Um, I'm gonna right stick to auto select our first choice. This is our first choice lineup, so you can see we're not we're not great. Um, we uh, we could go into the market and see if we can uh, we can sell some people and get rid of some people. Um, let's have a little look. We've got some centre backs here. We've got a couple of spare centre backs, um, but I think I have done a little bit of, of digging around. Some of them are, are way older than uh, than we would want, uh, so I think we're going to put some people up for sale. Um, so when we go to my team, I'm going to sort this by position. No, I'm not. I'm going to sort this by position. There we go. Uh, and let's have a little look. I think we'll get rid of, uh, we'll definitely get rid of Harvey. Um, we'll probably get rid of Jarvis. Um, Jarvis, I think, is quite young, but he is improving. Um, we'll definitely get rid of uh, Mahalov over here. We're going to add him to the list of players, I think. He does look like he's going to improve at some point, but... We've got too many, uh, how old are you? 24 and you're 23. 
We've got too many uh, too many strikers as it is. Arcas and Castle Dino are two best players, so we'll keep hold of those. Um, I think we can get rid of one of these left wingers uh, and maybe bring in a new left winger. Maybe that's what we do. Um, or maybe we bring in a new striker and we we push one of our wingers out into a support striker. Maybe that's the that's the move. Um, might not be a, bad, a, a terrible shout. And then with that being the case, we could... Uh, Oops, we could, um, he's like, what, am I staying or am I going? Uh, we could look to uh, to then buy a, a good left winger maybe, uh, but we do have lots of other people that we need to uh, to bring in. We need, um, we need new midfielders. We need, uh, we need good defensive midfielders. We definitely need a centre-back, uh, and I don't think it's going to be as easy to get those as we would like. Um, let's get rid of you. I don't know if, if it makes any difference putting them on the transfer market or not. And I think we're going to get rid of you because you're quite old. Uh, it does leave us a little short, but... Anyone else? You're a little bit rubbish, but you're one of our only centre-halves. We can get good money for you. I think he is pretty good, mind you. Uh, can he play defensive midfielder? He's on the way down. He's... We can get a million pounds for him. He's on two and a half grand wages. Um... And he is 34. I think we're going to, we'll add him to the list of players. We'll place on the transfer. Oh, I see. I think that's just adding them to the list for me down here. Okay. I get you. So now I can't do anything from here, right? I can't actually put them up for, for sale or anything. Well, that's pretty annoying. Okay, good. Um, Uh, we just need to, to work our way through this. I think some of these we did do and some of them we didn't. Um, we can probably get rid of Redmond or... Let's get let's get you on the list. What about, what about the central midfielders here? 24, 20, 34. We're getting rid of you, so we're going to only have two. We're not actually playing any... any uh, central midfielders from our, our current setup. So as you can see, we've only got £1,350 to spend on a on a, on a a player, so in terms of a, a weekly wage, so we're not going to be able to bring anyone good in. We could promote someone from our youth team, but uh, our best player wants three or four grand, so we're not going to be able to do that short term. I think we just, we just move forward in time. And off we go with... Our first set of negotiations coming up. Uh, and being able to get rid of players is going to be quite key. We don't want to leave ourselves too short. Oh, we didn't We didn't do any scouting. Um, let's scout for... We know we want a left winger, right? I think that's our... I think that's our goal. Let's get you scouting for still developing. Um, and we do want a centre half as well. We'll just do that. Okay, good. And this is this has gone and found a player, D Wheeler. We don't need a right midfielder, so we won't worry about that. I was hoping that was going to be an offer for one of our players, um, but uh, unfortunately not. Just the scouting report. Let's uh, let's keep going. So I've played a few games uh, on on superstar and uh, manual controls. It's real tough. I'm not going to lie. Um, and because you don't get enough of the ball to create chances when you do get a chance, you know, the shots are sometimes pretty terrible. Um, okay. We've got an offer coming for you. 810 K it's going to free up a, a grand as much. It's going to double our wage budget. I think we're just going to, we're just going to accept it. So we're up to 2,700 and we've got an offer in for shipper. Um, he's only on 630 uh, pounds a week but i think anything we can bring in here is beneficial to us um any other offers for any players oh down here good um this should be another 600 or so quid i'd imagine yeah it looks like it we're up to four grand so we could potentially um we could potentially find someone this annoys me a little bit not gonna lie it's quite demoralizing when you have to come over here and bring this down to to four grand Okay, um, I guess we can search for freebies, right? Oh, I've gone past them. 
Um, and I guess we'll search for a left winger for now. 236 players. I think we should bring the age cap down to maybe something like 28. Why not? So these are these are strikers who can play on the left from the looks of things. Did I get the did I get the search wrong? No, we did definitely say a left winger. Now there are certain things you can also look for. So you could say um, has a uh, a player skill, um, and maybe I don't really know if this will make any difference because because uh, obviously it's it's all manual. So I don't know how much of a difference these make. Uh, but let's go with pinpoint crosser for example, uh, and then it brings up these players. As you can see, this is the only player who's a left winger who looks like he. Uh, he could fit in. He's 24. He's not the quickest. Um, he's not that great, realistically, but he does have uh, a few things. Acrobatic finish, first time shooting, track back, fighting spirit. He's got a lot of these. I don't know how important these are. Um, I don't know how important they are, but they could be quite useful. Is he left or right footed? How do we tell? Um, he's right footed, so we could have him on the left cutting in. Um, might not be horrendous. Might not be horrendous. He's a freebie. Let's have a little look at how much they want for him. Or how much he wants. He wants two and a half or two and a bit grand. I think what we'll do is we'll just let it go on for a week or two. And see if we can up our wage budget. Um, and what I think that means is we'll play our first game. Um, which is after the squad announcement. <laughs> um, let's just get rid of this as well I think. Oh here we go. We have got. We have got a player in the in the list here. He's in the uh, left winger category. Um, super sub, first time shot. We've also got a uh, a couple of of players who aren't left wingers, but do look like they can play there. Let's have a little look at you. We probably want to get high speed and. Um, Oh, hello. No look passing. That's what we like to see. Um, that's what we're talking about. Acceleration, speed, not great. I think we want more than that for a winger. Let's have a little look at our our um, defenders. 29-year-old and 30-year-old. Um, heading 75, 184 centimetres. I think we'll probably go out and look for a defender with the heading ability. Um, but um, we also need speed in that. In that area. Okay. Our first game, everybody. Brace yourselves. You'll probably hear me swear. Here comes Stevie G for his uh, his first real press conference before the uh, before the start of the season. How do you feel right now? Um, we're ready for them. There we go. He says that without... Oh, no, he has moved his lips. Okay. Um, I certainly want to walk away with a win. We're up against Luton. Okay, this is a game we we need to be winning if we want to have any chance of of doing anything in the season. Is you know, not finishing bottom. We need to be beating a team like uh, like Luton, but I don't think we will. I don't. I'm yet to win a game, and you'll see why uh, in a second. So uh, the other thing that we've got is some kits, um, and as you can see, we've got our we've got our home kit, and I think we'll go with the home kit straight out of the bat. You'll have to wait for the additional kits. Uh, I think we're just going to go with this. We'll see what happens. Uh, normally, I, in this game, I like to play with three strikers, usually with uh, with a real high winger. Um, but I think we'll just go with with something like this and see what see what happens. Oh no, I didn't look at my bench to make sure our bench had cover well, in all positions. That's bad news. Far back in the distance, memories of last season, positions and points tallies on the last day. That's all now irrelevant. It is all about the ultimate prize that lies a long way ahead. That buoyant feeling is here. New start, fresh hope. Get the season off to a fly. Okay, here we go. Look at him walking out in the yellow kit. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognized. Right, let's get let's get started, shall we? In the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. 
Right, so, so you'll notice some of these passes start going awry, especially if I panic. Um, oh, God, that wasn't meant to go there. Obviously, it wasn't meant to go there. The increasing wealth that attracts the best talent and management and of course greater expectation the boundaries have to continue being stretched and to the limit supporters have an insatiable appetite to well, they're in already they're in already keeps oh no how did that happen so one of the things i really struggle with in manual is not being able to header the ball but it was a pretty pretty small centre back I think he went up for that header wasn't it and then we committed to go, go and win the ball we didn't win it and there they are straight off the bat how long did we last? 5 minutes ok we're better than this I know that oh god we're not better than this I take it all back for so many Jim of course that means new boss it does indeed no question that's been a big talking point yeah absolutely the new man certainly excited no. to talk about his vision uh, ahead of the game hoist it forward okay we just need a bit of composure and Let's someone like Stevie forward. G in the middle of the park there we go we won a header to no one can we win another Vasil we can but it's just going to keep coming back get that clear Palestine. I guess we'll try it. We haven't got a lot else to aim for. And that has been cleared. And that's been one straight back. Hetic. Oh. And we managed at least three passes together then. I don't know if you noticed. I'm quite pleased with it. Ooh. Tries to get it forward quickly. Vasil cuts it out. Okay, we we can do this. They are playing quite defensive, so maybe we could. Uh, maybe we could. Oh come on! It was right there. It was right there. Uh, maybe we could go a little bit more attacking at some point, uh, fairly soon. But uh, let's just find a feet a little bit if we can. To the right. Oh god. Another attack. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. How is it their free kick? Well, I think the alternative was to you having there a laugh. Do nothing while he, he tried to score and obviously he's not going to allow that Peter, is he? Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just You having an morning. actual laugh. Oh, maybe it was a free kick. <laughs> Oh, God. We're going to go 2-0 down, right? They're not missing this. He's having a goal. Oh, come on. He's got himself a pinch of a goal. Okay, 2-0 was a big ask. And threatening to pull clear. And he's produced a beauty. Okay, let's go more attacking. We, we need it. Take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Okay, we're not getting a lot of movement either. Castle Dime. Goyos. Oh. It's a bit scrappy down here. They're getting a lot of men behind the ball. Breaks on here. Get up. Seifert. Jorza. Carlson. Oh. Even those passes they're cutting out. So we've gone a little bit more attacking in the hope that whilst they're being very defensive. Being played forward. Um, and, and the other hope is that we can deal with them um, coming back. forward, which we haven't managed to even though we've already been defensive. Cleared without complication. I think one of our best players is on the bench as well. Well, hopefully he's on the bench. Oh, 
We'll take that. We're getting a little bit of a little bit of possession higher up the pitch. That's important. Castle Dine. Forward it goes. Oh god, I'm running the defender up. I didn't mean to do that. Chance to play it in. Jorza gets it back. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Oh, come so on. No nonsense defending. They're in again. And the shot. Well done, Keeps. Jeez. All because we lost the ball in the middle of the park. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Can we deal with a corner, I wonder? Let the keeper gather that. Through to the goalkeeper. Carlson. Castle Dine. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Approaching half time and still behind. Oh. Something happened now. They're always quicker to the ball than I am. I guess it's because they're AI, right? Um, they're always moving towards it when I'm not. And it's played forward. But Manaman. Great strength. Too strong for his opponent. Why is our center half running other pitch? Carlson. We do not have a lot of support here. Okay. Just refuses to be out muscled. Ref. Nothing. Nothing at all. I mean, it felt like he kicked me. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. How did he get up before me and still get the bloody ball? Oh god, he's far quicker than me. Cut out in the nick of time. Okay. It's not been a great first half. I'm not going to lie. Uh, we need better in the second half. We've not had a single shot. Look at our bench. Our bench is a problem. Our bench is a real problem. Should have really looked at that. Not, not a great start for the first game. I've gone in with no attackers on the bench. Okay. That gets things going for the second half. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is I mean, I suspect there'll be questions goal. asked about Stevie G on the, on the first game. Going in, in with no, no attacking players game. on the bench. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. I don't know if our, our centre half is just short or if their strike is pretty big. I'm not sure. Hetic. Oh, come on. The other thing you might notice is we move the ball really slowly because I'm, I'm concentrating so much on getting the pass right. And that's been levered clear and it's been taken straight back. Cleared away. So that line's a little guideline um, that you can bring up by holding left trigger, uh, just to, to give you a bit of assistance with your with your passes. Not quite what we were looking for. That and the through ball is intercepted. Oh God! I thought I was going to have to challenge for it. <laughs> I thought I was going to have to challenge for it. It turned out I got there first and that was my shot. Uh, and that's one thing you'll notice is because there's no assists. Oh, that was terrible. Because there's no assists, if you're shooting in that direction, it's going in that direction. Right, 
Well done. Okay, come on, boys. Palace start. We've got to see her. Oh, come on. Now, if this deficit is to be recovered, no holding back and being patient about this challenge. It's time to roll the sleeves up and, and go for it. Gets into a dangerous position. Oh, God, here they come again. How did I not get there? Well read, he saw oh, why didn't you get rid of it? Oh, he pressed clear and he just turned and looked. Oh, he had the opportunity to clear. He had the chance to clear. Instead, he just kind of fell over. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Well, it helps if you intercept the ball. Literally in their area. Goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Seifert. Pallister. We're okay when there's no pressure on us. As in when we've got the ball uh, in these sorts of areas and they're not closing us down. Caught him there. It's a free kick. Okay. It's not been the start we hoped for. That is not great. <laughs> Tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, but come on. Even then I can't get the ball. They're they're in again, I think. They're in again. Well done. Hetic. Hoist it forward. My ball is not on. Oh. Helps if I ran towards the ball first, I think. Luton are bringing out the tricks. Oh, man. Come on, boys. I would like to know um, how good their players are in comparison to ours. Uh, we should probably make some subs as well. Not that I've really got any that I can I can change. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Knocks it away. Goyos conjuring up some magic on the right hand side. Hetic. Seifert. Pallister. This is the problem. They've, look how many people they've got back. Hetic. And we're just not getting it. Oh, God. We're just not getting any space at all in behind. Not that that would help, but... Oh, we didn't have enough pace on it. Oh, I should have just held it up. Should have just held it up. Break here. Jorza. Carlson. And it's hoisted clear. Oh god, I don't think I'm going to keep that in. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Just about. I wonder if we could have a shot in this game. There it was. 
You saw it. It was from miles out and didn't get past the first defender. Oh, I thought we might have a chance. He's in, surely. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Away from immediate danger. And it's played forward. Well, that's where he wants it. Not the ball. Not the ball we were looking for. And there goes well. The final whistle. Well, well, well. Shinny scored a couple. Um, and Collins. It's not been a great it's not been a great start. I mean we, we went with a poor lineup to be fair. I'm not sure this formation is for us. Um, but it wasn't great. We did have more possession, but they kind of backed off. Um, one shot on target. Pretty poor performance from the players in the middle and the striker. We'll make some changes for the next game. Um, the first episode done. I, I don't know how you're going to feel about this. It's going to be a lot of losses. Um, if you enjoy it, please let me know and there'll be more. Um, if not, please let me know and there'll be less. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.